Hi guys, it's Taylor. In today's video, I'm sharing my monthly picks from Princess Polly. So thank you, Princess Polly, for sponsoring this video. I will have all of these items in the size that I got linked in the description box. And if you want to shop any of these pieces or anything on their website, you can use my 20% off discount code XOTAYLOR. I also want to note that Princess Polly offers free express three to four day shipping to the US on orders over 50 US dollars. And they also offer afterpay and shop pay to all US customers. I think that's it, so let's get into it. Let's start off with a pair of shoes. Aren't these adorable? They remind me of Catwoman. But I've been wanting a pair of knee-high black heeled boots like this for a while. I just haven't been able to find the perfect pair. I'm mad at myself though because I remembered that in one of my previous Princess Polly videos, I made a mental note that their shoes run big so I need to size down and I forgot to do that. So these are a little bit big on me, but they're so cute. I just got this like smooth patent leather one. They also have a really cool crocodile print, but I just thought these were a lot more wearable and I'm very excited to dress these up for just like dinners and stuff with my friends. So cute. These are called the Jesse Boots Black and I got them in a seven. Should have got them in a six though. Cries. I just have two accessories. Firstly being these socks. These are called the Ribbed Ruffle Socks White and I just thought they were so cute. I couldn't pass up their little ankle frilled socks. These remind me of when I was a child. When I would go to church with my family, I would always wear these and it's just very nostalgic. All of my socks are just plain, so I thought these were really cute to add a pop to your outfit. And then I just got this gold hair clip. This is more for like half up hairstyles. Let me show you guys how I would put it in. I would just take half my hair and do that. And it's perfect and cute and I just love that it's gold because I'm a gold girl and I just really like how it was like an outline. There's not a lot of like plastic or whatever on it. All right, moving in to the clothing. We'll start off with the top that I'm wearing right now. Is this not the most stunning top you've ever seen? The color is absolutely beautiful. I have discovered that I love purple. I think it looks really good with my hair and my skin tone. It's in a really nice light kind of mesh fabric and then it has this really cool like dotted button up detail that cuts across. I just thought it was really cool. I've never seen anything like it. You can actually like undo them so you could like have some popping open if it's your vibe. I think this would look really good with no bra, but I unfortunately can't do that. So maybe I'll just wear like a black bralette under it just so you could see it popping through. But I'm just wearing a nude bra under this. And this is called the Mystic Wonder Top Purple us2 to me this is the perfect going out top just because i am fuller chested so when i'm going out i'd like to feel like secure but this detail still makes it a little bit more scandalous <laughs> speaking of going out tops the next one i got is called the becca long sleeve crop top black and i got this in a size us2 this was questionable because i wasn't sure if i was going to fit in it and I'm still trying to decide if it looks good. I just don't know if I would feel confident enough to wear it out like if I'm drinking because you know I don't want to do anything stupid and then fall out of the top. It's not that secure as you guys can see It's definitely made for girls with a smaller chest But I have a purple underwired long sleeve top from princess Polly that I got in the summer and It fits me like a glove. So I wanted to try a different style, but this one definitely isn't as supportive so maybe keep that in mind if you guys have a bigger chest i got my regular size which is a two and it fits me perfectly around here if i sized up it would be too loose i just honestly can't really win with these tops but i still wanted to try it out just a really nice rib thick comfortable material it's a very well-made top next up i have a dress i was so 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 excited about this it is unfortunately too small for me i'm not kidding it took me over 10 minutes to get it on <laughs> i got it in a size 2 and i'm honestly debating buying it in a size up because that's how much i love it it is so stunning everything about this is just i like this is me in a dress it's called the ivy corset mini black dress and like i said i got it in a size 2 but size up if you guys are going to get this it's basically a black corset strapless 
mini dress. What really gets you is it's not stretchy at all. The section for your chest to go in is pretty small, but the top does have that sticky feature to hold you up. It was just so tight here that I couldn't pull it up any further. And there was like so much extra fabric down here. You guys will see in the try on, it was like bunching up there. So I just think I need a size bigger, which I think I'm going to order because I'm obsessed with it. I have this Shelby mini skirt in black that I got last time I worked with Princess Polly and I love it so much. So I decided to get it in this gray color. I've actually had my eye on this for a while and it's been sold out for months. So when I saw that it was in stock, I needed to get it or Selby. I thought it was Shelby. It's called the Selby mini skirt gray and this I sized up to a four in just because I previously had a two and it's very short. It runs very small. It's a linen material and there's no slits or anything. I just love how basic it is. It's such a good staple. I have a few black skirts but the gray is a very nice neutral color to add to your outfit. And it's still like darker like this with a black blazer and a white baby tee would be so cute. Speaking of blazers, I got a gray one. This is called the Talisa Oversized Blazer Gray. And I got this in a size small medium. I honestly wouldn't really say that it's oversized though. So if you guys want a very baggy oversized fit, just get the largest size. I would say this fits pretty fitted. Maybe I'm just so used to everything being like a men's large on me. So I have no concept of what's fitted and oversized anymore and it's the perfect shade of gray i actually got these two to wear together i was really hoping they were going to be the same shade but they're not i think if i wear them together it would still look cute i don't have any blazers from princess polly but i'm very impressed by this and it's such good quality finishing off with a jacket this is actually my favorite piece that i got this is called the ellery coat gray and i got this in a medium large just because i wasn't sure if it was going to be oversized so i wanted to make sure that i could bundle up and layer under it and i am so happy with the way that it fits i maybe could have gone down to a small medium but i'd rather it be a little bit too big than too small i'm so impressed with the quality of this jacket as well and I've been looking for a long black and white coat like this forever. So I honestly wasn't surprised that Princess Polly had it because they always have what I'm looking for. You guys will see a lot better in the trim because it's hard for me to hold up. You guys will definitely be seeing this a lot because I am going to wear it to the ground. All right, guys, that is everything that I picked up this month from Princess Polly. I will have all of these items and the size that I got linked down below if you guys are interested in picking them up. And also, don't forget to use my 20% off discount code XOTaylor. Let me know in the comments what your favorite piece was. Mine is definitely this coat, but I love you guys and I will see you in a few days. Bye.